Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. On June the 24th, 1981, six young people from the small town of Medjugorje in the then country of Yugoslavia claimed to have received a vision of the Virgin Mary on a hillside just outside the town. Almost 30 years later, the visionaries of Medjugorje still claim to have daily visitations, and since 1981, it is estimated that over 30 million pilgrims have made the trip to that small Bosnian town. Tonight, we're joined by one of those six visionaries, so would you please welcome Vishka, along with her interpreter, Manuela Spinelli, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to you both. So, would you, would you tell us how old you were in June 1981? First of all, I would like to say a couple of words before answering your of question. Course. I want to say hello to all of you, first of all. I'm very happy to be here amongst you. I'm very happy to be here amongst you. Trasmettere il messaggio della Madonna che lei dare a me io posso dire a tutti voi. And above all, I'm happy because I can give you the message from Our Lady, and I'm happy to be here to be able to transmit it to all of you. Ecco, e adesso rispondo. Now I can answer your question. 24 giugno 1981 è stato il giorno di San Giovanni. On the 24th of June, 81, was the feast of St. John the Baptist. And that day I went to school in Mostar. And when I go back home, my sister Zdenka told me that uh, um, Maria and, um, Ivanka, Miria and Ivanka mm. were looking for me. E anche loro già hanno lasciato un messaggio dove posso trovare. And they left a message to my sister to let her, let her know where I could find them. Perché noi tante volte siamo andati a fare una passeggiata. Ivana, Ivanka, che lei abitava a Mostar, e Miriam a Sarajevo, arrivano da sui noni per ferie. We used to go for walks because Miriana and Ivanka used to come on holidays uh, to the village. One lived in Sarajevo and the, the other one lived in Mostar. They came to their grandparents on holidays. E così sono andata a cercare a loro per la strada e visto e loro tre sono state Miriana, Ivanka e sorella di Maria. And um, I went to look for them and um, uh, it was Miriam, Ivanka, and uh, Milka, Milka, who was uh, Miriam's sister. Che a me. They came towards me. Così sono tutte dispaventate, dicono, ma Vizca, vieni, vieni, così vicino. And they were all scared, and they were telling me, Vizca, Vizca, come closer, come closer. Ma io ho pensato qualche cosa di paura di animale o così. And I thought they might be scared for some wild animal or something. E sono venuta vicino, e loro già detto a me, ma Vizca, sai, è arrivata la Madonna. And when I came close to them, they told me, Vizca, Vizca, we, we saw Our Lady. Ma io subito a quel momento ho pensato, sicuro c'è qualcosa che loro che non va. And I thought there must be something wrong with them. E dopo sono andata vicino e ritornata dietro. I, I actually left. E visto Ivan, nostro leggente. And I met Ivan, who is also one of the visionary. E dico Ivan. E loro dicano che vedono la Madonna, andiamo anche tu fai compagnia, stiamo vicino a loro. And I told him, I said, even they said that they saw our lady, so come with me, so we, we can go and have a look. Siamo venuti vicino e sono girata a po' testa e visto Ivan non c'era. And as we went back, uh, he was coming with me and I turned around, turned my head and he was actually gone. E Ivan è già scappato he, he had così. run off. <laughs> non per quella strada, da un bosco e è andato subito. And he didn't even go back the normal way, he took a shortcut. E dopo io sono rimasta di là e loro dicono, ma visca, guarda che la Madonna è bella, che lei chiama proprio con sua mano che possiamo avvicinarci. I stayed there and they were saying to me, look, look how beautiful she is and look how she is motioning to you to come, cl to us to come closer. Ma io questo momento è guardato solo sulla terra. But I couldn't look up. I, I kept looking on the ground. Ma non ho paura della Madonna, ma c'è una cosa più forte di me. It wasn't as if I was scared of Our Lady, but there was something 
stronger than me that was blocking me. E dopo qualche momento la mia testa piano piano da sola si alzava proprio al posto dove la Madonna. And then all of a sudden my, my head just naturally lifted up and I looked up where Our Lady was. What, did, what can I ask you, what, she, what did she look like when you, look, when you looked up? Com'è, com'è, com'è la Madonna, puoi sì. descriverla? Mm, ma guarda, finisco quello, solo due parole. I just want to finish. As wish. <laughs> eh, no, no, please. Something. Yeah. E così, sai, la Madonna così è fatto che possiamo venire, ma prima sera siamo ritornati a casa, non siamo andati vicino. Our Lady was motioning to us to come closer, but we didn't, not on that night, we actually left. Così già detto, andiamo domani, facciamo una passeggiata, che la Madonna viene, possiamo dire anche altro. And we thought, we'll go back tomorrow, and we'll see if she comes again, and if we can talk to her. Così domani siamo andati stessa ora, fare una passeggiata, e la Madonna già aspettava. And we went back the following day, same time, and she was waiting on e us. Così è ogni and since then we've had apparitions every day. Guarda, prima che la Madonna viene e viene luce tre volte, e questo è segno che arriva. Before she comes, uh, light flashes three times and that's the sign that she's coming. E dopo viene con vestito grigio. And then she comes and she's dressed in a grey uh, dress. E veo bianco. With a white veil. Capelli neri. She has dark hair. E occhi azzurri. And blue eyes. E c'è una nuvola grigia sotto piedi. And uh, she's, uh, under her feet is a grey cloud. Solo quando arrivano grandi feste, Natale, Pasqua, compleanno, anniversario. Only on big occasions like uh, Christmas or Easter or birthdays. E la Madonna viene tutta di oro. Then, in, then she comes dressed in gold. E ogni volta per Natale la Madonna viene con piccolo bambino in braccio appena nato. And for Christmas she comes with baby Jesus. Solo qualche anno fa per venerdì santo e la Madonna è venuta con Gesù grande. And a couple of years ago um, at Easter on Good Friday she came with Jesus as an adult. È stato tutto sanguinato. And he was bleeding. Tutta roba fasciata, corona di spine. He had... Um, the, the crown of thorns. E la Madonna dice, ma sono venuta con Gesù grande, che voi vedete quanto è Gesù sofferto per tutti noi. And she told us, our lady told us that she came with uh, Jesus as, a, as an adult because she wanted us to realize and see with our own eyes how much Jesus had mm. suffered for ma us. Ma l'unica cosa che non si può descrivere è bellezza della Madonna. But the only thing that I cannot describe to you is how beautiful our Lady is. Ma non esiste nessuna cosa bella come la Madonna. But there is nothing um, as beautiful as her. E una volta già chiesto la Madonna, ma perché sei così bella? And I asked her once, why are you so beautiful? E la Madonna ha risposto e dice, ma sono bella perché amo. And she answered to me and she said, I'm beautiful because I love. Ma dovete amare a voi per essere belli. You have to love if you want to be beautiful. Ma quella bellezza non arriva da fuori, arriva proprio profondamente, direttamente in nostro cuore. And that beauty doesn't come from the outside, it comes from within our hearts. E la Madonna dice, ma voi oggi siete troppo preoccupati di quella bellezza di fuori? And uh, Our Lady says that nowadays we are too worried about external beauty. E dimenticato quella bellezza più importante, quella bellezza di nostro cuore, di nostra anima. And we forget the most important beauty, which is the beauty of our soul and the beauty of our heart. Okay. Così okay. la okay. Madonna vuole uh, che noi pensiamo un po' di più quella bellezza dentro. E quando abbiamo quella bellezza dentro, quella da fuori arriva da sola senza and preoccupazioni. And she would like us to okay. think a little bit more to the beauty that we have inside, because once we have beauty inside, then the external beauty will come on its own. I, I do apologize. I don't want to be rude to you. But I have so, so many questions I'd like to ask. Io quando finisco... No, I always e like I giving a little speech and then yeah. when I'm finished, okay. you can ask Is it okay if I ask some questions? Allora, ora no, posso farti yeah, yeah. Certo. no, no, thank you. I, I, did, no. I didn't want to stop you because you, you, you were in the moment and I understand that I'm tired. Ogni domanda che aveva sua risposta, 
Are you Pimir Scofino? No, because yeah. I know you have a few questions okay. to ask me, okay. so I wanted to no say what I wanted thank to you. say thank first. You. Well, just a few quick questions anyway. Um, for example, wh why does, does uh, Our Lady appear to, to you and your friends? Why does to you and your friends? I asked Our Lady once, why did you choose us? E la Madonna ha già detto, ma questo è stata volontà di Dio, non sua volontà, and ma Dio è voluto così, è scelto a noi. And she answered that it wasn't her will, she didn't choose us, it was God who chose us. And can I ask you about the secrets? You've been told t ten secrets, is that correct? Posso Maybe? chiederle dei segreti, chiederti sì. dei segreti, perché mm, sì. ti sono stati rivelati quanti segreti. Sì, ma guarda, io adesso avevo nove segreti. I have nine secrets. Yes. Solo che adesso posso dire questo terzo segreto è il segreto di quello segno che la Madonna lascia qui sul podbordo. The only secret I can talk about is the third one which has already been revealed and it's uh, the fact that Our Lady will leave, will leave uh, a tangible, visible sign on the podbordo, on the, on the hill, on the Hill. E questo segno rimane per sempre per sua presenza che la Madonna è stata qui in mezzo di noi. This sign will remain, will stay forever, and it will be a sign that Our Lady was with us. Anche più per quelli che sono ancora lontani di Dio. And it's uh, specific, particularly for those who are still uh, far away from God. Do we know when this will happen? Is e there a time frame? Quando questo succederà? Ma guarda, anche io questo momento lo so. Aspetto Look, quando I la Madonna da... I don't even know eh. myself. I'm waiting for Our Lady to let me know. H have you been given... Um, what are described as graces, and some might call a burden. Is this the case? Ti sono state date, dati dei doni, delle grazie, che però potrebbero anche essere dei fardelli in un certo senso. Sì, ma guarda, il Signore dà diversi doni. God gives us different graces. Solo dipende di noi come siamo pronti a accettare questo grande dono. And it's up to us to accept those graces. Che adesso io spiego un po' Uh, come la Madonna ha già detto, ma una sofferenza è una malattia e così è uno grande dono che Dio dà. And suffering, in my case, is a great gift that I was given by Our Lady. Ma tante volte noi pensiamo, ma come può essere quello dono? And we, I know we may think, how can you think of it as a, as a grace, as yes. a gift? E la Madonna ha già detto, ma questo è uno grande dono. And she told us this is a great a ma great gift. E anche già detto, ma noi prima che viene questo dono possiamo dire, ma Signore, perché a me dai qualcuno altro? Dobbiamo prima allontanare che viene. But before we're able to accept this, this uh, burden, uh, we have to dis disassociate from it and wonder why do you want me to have it? E la Madonna ha già detto, ma dobbiamo dire, ma Signore ti ringrazio per questo dono. But we should simply say thanks to God for giving us this, this Che gift. tu hai ancora qualcosa per dare. And that we still have, we all have something to give. E solo prendere, ma solo chiedo la tua forza e coraggio che io possa andare avanti. And all we should ask of God is the strength uh, to continue to go on. E anche la Madonna ha già detto, ma voi non sapete quanto valore aveva nostra malattia su davanti sull'occhio di Dio. And uh, Our Lady has already told us that illness and uh, has a lot of value in the eyes of God. Have, has Our Lady shown you heaven, Mishka? La, la Madonna ti ha fatto vedere il paradiso. Sì, ma guarda, un giorno io e Iaco siamo stati la sua casa. One day, Jacob and I were, were in his house. E la Madonna ha già detto, adesso andate con me a vedere paradiso e purgatorio interno. And our lady came and told us we would go with her to see heaven, purgatory and hell. E questo momento, Jacob ha detto, ma guarda la Madonna, tu porti visca perché sono tanti fratelli e sorelle, io sono unico figlio. And uh, Jacob said, our lady, bring visca because she she has eight, well, there are eight brothers and sisters, so you can bring her and I'll stay back, I'll stay behind. Ma io questo momento penso, ma guarda quante ore, quanti giorni, dove si va, o sopra, o sotto. And I was 
I was thinking how long it takes, how many hours it's gonna take, are we going up or down? E la Madonna presa me destra mano e io con sinistra lei davanti e portava. And Our Lady took me on the, um, on, in her right arm and uh, Jacob in, his, in her left arm and then she took us with her. Ma tetto si solo aperto per passare. And the roof of the house opened to let us go through. Da un secondo si è venuto in paradiso. And in, within one second we were in heaven. E visto uno grande spazio. We saw a large space. Ma una luce che non esiste là qui sulla terra. A light that uh, doesn't exist on earth. E visto persone tutte uguali, no magri, no grassi, tre colori vestiti, grigio e giallo e rosso. And people were all the same. There were no thin people, overweight people. They were all the same and they were dressed in three colors, gray, yellow and red. Tutti girano, cantano, pregano, i piccoli angeli volano. They were all running about, praying, the, uh, singing, and there were little angels flying in the sky. E la Madonna dice, ma guardate, quanto sono felice e contente queste persone che sono qui in paradiso. And our lady told us, look, look how happy these people are in, in paradise. Ma una gioia che non si può descrivere, che non esiste la qui sulla terra. It was an indescribable joy that doesn't exist on earth. Can I, can I be very rude and, and interrupt again? Um, interrompo di nuovo. Because I just need to put the case for people who, who, who don't believe uh -huh. and, and, and put it to you that, that, that there will be people watching tonight, people in the audience who will be watching who will say it's not possible, um, it's very okay. difficult to comprehend why, you, why you'd say this. Certo. I'm sure you, you, you will understand the question. Look, I haven't come here to force people to believe. Yes. Ma io sono venuta qui proprio dire quella mia esperienza, ma questa verità. E dopo dipende di voi come accettate questa. I have come here to tell you my, of my experience, yeah. uh, and then it's up to you. I, I'm here to witness what I have lived, and then it's up to you to believe it or not. E anche la Madonna dice, ma il Signore ha dato una libertà completamente. And Our Lady always says, God gave us freedom, Siamo tutti complete liberi. freedom, we are all free. Chi vuole credere, la Madonna dice eccomi, chi non vuole aspetto. So if you want to believe, Our Lady will say here I am, and if you don't want to believe, then she'll wait. We have one such person, is because obviously around the world people believe, don't believe, okay, but one person who does, who does believe is, is uh, somebody who's uh, uh, known to a lot of people around uh, the country as a member of Dove and uh, Eurostar and so on. Uh, Hazel Keynes Warren, good evening Hazel. Good evening. Um, you're familiar with Vishka? I am familiar. Um, I'm in awe really sitting here and listening to the story because I've read it so many times in all the different books. Um, I had um, a little boy in uh, 2008 who was born with a rare disorder that none of the doctors could understand what he had. And uh, he was in Our Lady's Hospital on Nazareth Ward. And um, I, I sat reading all the books about Medjugorje because I wanted to search anywhere to try and find a cure for him. And um, I went to Medjugorje in 2009 uh, with my friend Una, who, who introduced me to Medjugorje, and uh, I, that was in May, and in June he came home from hospital. He's on a machine at home, but he's home. You know, so I, I took him home from hospital. So, so do, do you attribute that directly to Medjugorje? Oh, 100 percent. Yeah. Why, 100%. why are you so convinced that it wasn't because, just a, a medical quirk? Um, because nobody in the hospital, as much as the doctors and the nurses were absolutely brilliant in the hospital, but yeah. we searched the four corners of the world to try and find out what he had, and basically he has a rare disorder that he can't have any carbohydrates, so. There's nobody in the world that they, they know has this disorder. And um, uh, my friend Una had introduced me to Medjugorje the year before, and I wasn't really interested because, like, why would I want to go to Medjugorje? Yes. But when you're basically and physically on your knees, you, you pray to God. Yes. And that's and what I did. And you think your prayers were answered rather Absolutely. than that, that it was just yeah, a medical toll? To, to yeah, no, 100%. I believe 100%. I went to Medjugorje. I saw so many miracles in Medjugorje. I saw the sun spin. I, you know, I witnessed things myself that other people on the trip didn't witness, but I felt it was my time to go to Medjugorje. And I mean, there's so many coincidences. He was born on the 7th of October. It's uh, the feast day of a uh, Lady of the Rosary. So, you know, I believe that there's um, like 
God instances, like, you know, God puts things in your way. And I, I definitely do believe my son was put, given to me as a gift and he's put me on a whole new path, you know, a path that I never thought I'd ever go on. Okay, and Vishka, this is a story I'm sure you've heard yes. many times before. And when you hear a story like that, what, 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 how do you feel? E quando senti una storia del genere, come ti senti? Come ti fa sentire? Ma guarda, questa è una cosa bella. Anche io sento tantissime storie. Sono tante persone che sono avute quello dono di guarigione, o fisicamente, o di più di spiritualmente. Così sono sempre doni. This is something very beautiful, and I hear many stories like this. And there are many, many cases of people who have had either uh, physical or um, spiritual healing. It's been very nice having you with us this evening, and I'm, I know a lot of people are very happy to, to know that you were coming on our program, and I hope you have a good and uh, safe time in Ireland. Thanks for coming to see us on the program tonight. Vishka, ladies and gentlemen, and Manuel Spinelli helping out again. And that's it for part two. Join us after the break. Plenty more to come. Thank you.